Hello and welcome to this video. In this video, we will see how to bundle two or more products for your Shopify store. So, if you are selling multiple products in your Shopify store and these products are related to each other, like some facial cream or any other products, we can bundle them and increase our average order value. So, bundling products also increase our revenue in our store. So, people can purchase uh, two or three products together to, and also get a 10 to 20 percent discount so uh, we'll see how to add this type of bundle in our shopify store very easily so for this we will need an app so the app is bundle b bundles builder so i'll put a link in the description to check this out so all you need is a shopify store so if you already have a shopify store then we can start right from here and you will also find a link uh, to sign up for a special link for your shopify store for just one dollar and also the link of this app so this app has a free plan and also seven day trial so this is a, a app that will give you a one bundle for completely free and then we can go to the other plan as needed okay based on your shopify plan so you will just need to click on the add app option if you want to install this app because by default shopify uh, cannot have the bundle together feature so we need to use this type of app so this app will do this work for us so just click on add app and this will add the app in our store like any other shopify app uh, that we use and then just click on install app and this will install the shopify app and the process is similar like any other app store uh, is installation process after that we will see a dashboard just like this of this app and we just need to enable the app okay just click on enable the app this is the button click on this enable the app so this will enable the app for us now we have ready to start building our bundles now you can see we have a build a new bundle option where we can click and start building the bundle and we have other option in the dashboard so this is the dashboard of this app which you can find go to apps and you will can access these apps anytime by clicking this from the apps okay currently it is already open so we don't need to check anywhere else so now we will now we will discuss how to create a bundle just like this example in my store i will show you how i will i will create this and what you can do as well so let's get started with it okay now we'll click on this uh, build a new bundle so now let's create the first bundle so we'll click on build a new bundle this option so click on this and now we need to choose a name for our bundle so first of all let's give this a name like bundle so you can give this the name based on your product so in that case i will just bundle two of my products in our in my store uh, let me show you which of these two products this product cleanser and fsl scrub so i can name based on this product like cleanser plus scrub something like this so i can remember cleanser plus scrub so i can remember which products i have bundled with the name okay so you can change this anytime you can give a tag for this as well so we can do that bundle specific specify level so what is the level it should be product level or variant level if you want to just choose one type of product like if you have a product which is multiple color like black yellow green you just want to give the bundle only for black color you can do that but in that case uh, my product does not have any variant and uh, i will suggest you always go to the product level so people have all the option from the product to choose from if you have a multiple color or size then you can give bundle of a type it should be custom bundle not the tired bundle we will dis uh, cover this also in another video so this is uh, actually related to the uh, bundle mix and match bundle or frequently bought together the type of bundle we are seeing right here and tired bundle actually means that one quantity two quantity three quantity uh, the more people buy the more discount they will get so we'll go with this custom bundle offer because this type of bundle we want to create we want to bundle two products together then the bundle is the products bundle display optional so uh, control which product the bundle automatically display this this bundle will be showed to the product that we will bundling like the true proof product that we have sh showed here will be showed this bundle will be showed to this product page of this two product and also we can also add this product to the specific page or with embed could only option but i will go with the products in the bundle so it showed in the product then click on these arrows okay then horizontal why switch type of layout we want to create for this bundle so i will just like this type of for the better user experience this is the horizontal view i mostly like we can go to this wide horizontal also but this is the better look 
for desktop and mobile i like this one but you can also choose this particular one or wide horizontal offer as well but i will go with the horizontal one then click the next option again and which type of bundle we want to create first of all we need to add products so click on add products and this will show only the active products in our store so the products that already active uh, any product that in the draft or in the other mode will not be able to work so these products are not in my uh, this product is not in my bar. so let me uh, search for the products uh, my other product is also showing so let me search for the cleanser okay cleanser so this is the cleanser and another one is scrub okay radiant scrub so these are the two products that i want to bundle so you can see already two products added and this is the look we will get preview buy this bundle and save and then you can see how many quantity this should be one what type of percentage of it could be 20 percent 50 percent as well you get 10 to 20 percent okay you can give the schedule the bundle as well like if you are just uh, running this bundle offer for a particular time like uh, for a halloween or for a christmas then you can just choose this start and end date this if this is a specific spe special for any occasion like mother's day father's day you can click on start day and choose a day you can click on end day and choose a day but i will not uh, specify those bundle time it will be available all the time and then i later if i want i can also disable this and for per per percentage of you can just go with the percentage you can go with the fixed amount you can go with the fixed price you can go with the free shipping if they get this together the shipping will be get free but uh, as well i will suggest to use the percentage of and you can say, change this message as well bundle title message like, like you can see 20 percent of any screen combo you can change this buy buy this bundle and save 10 percent 10 percent uh 10 10 percent right now okay just like this you can just change this okay you can see this will be changed so then click on the next button now you can see you can click on create a custom you can use a preset so what this means is you can change those look how these are looking so you can click on the text and you can go in the font family it should be default coming from your theme and also the font size you can increase or decrease the size like bundle title message as you can see that message title is title is increasing this this title is increasing you can go with the bold you can see if i go with the bold this one this is this one is changing the top one okay and then bundle product details you can just increase the font size to 18 pixel this one so it should look something bold okay not exactly the same then you can go with the font color which type of color you want to choose you want to choose a specific color to your brand you can choose the hex code here and also it should be center or left align you can choose this as well same goes for the product image okay you can uh, border color everything can be changed but i will not touch this and also same goes for the button you can change the add to cut button text to any other color any other text and also it should be wide or something like this cover or not what is the alignment should be uh, what is the font size should be i will go with the 16 i would like to give it an 18 pixel as you can see it should look something more large than this you can also go for the button gradient option of course gradient button as well but in that case i will not choose any gradient button and for the animation you can ask for a shake animation as you can see but it does not look good so i will not uh, put for this make button bigger make button smaller this type of thing but i will go with whatever we have so you can do all the changing here as i showed like you can ask uh, change the font size as we did before you can change the font type how should look it should be bold or not something like this of our price and same goes for the button uh, you can just uh, increase the size a little bit more you can do the alignment text everything if some color is not matching to your brand you can change it from here and then click this next arrow icon and now where it should show display re uh, relative uh, to the add to cart feature okay so i will always like it to be showed inside below okay it should be below add to cart or above the add to cart or we can show it to the show it to the custom position as well and we will see how we can show it to the custom position as well so click save and launch it should be showed below inside below add to cart button okay now the bundle has been launched and it is uh, live 
okay now let's uh, see the product page if it is showing or not so you can see this is my product page nourishing cleanser and you can see that buy this bundle and save it is already working well so if i click on add to card let me see it is working or not so you can see it is redirecting me to the card page so how we can change these settings as well like if you click on this setting there is other setting there is other setting as well now you can see there is a subtotal bundle discount total how many things thank you for claiming our bundle offer okay so this type of thing is showing how we can change those you can see there is an option called card discount message you can enable this or disable this you can if you disable this this won't be showed again this card discount message if i enable this and click on edit button i can see which type of message it is showing so you can see thank you for claiming our bundle offer this message message is coming from here and you can control all of this and the subtotal is also there the discount could be automatically applied at at checkout okay you can change those messages as well if you want to and card uh, price display setting it is also enabled as you can see how this is showing height subtotal you can see subtotal bundle discount total so this is looking good you can also price position above the subtotal below the subtotal you can cho choose the setting as well so then there is a general setting if you click on this you can see redirect page what page it should be redirect if you want to redirect it directly to the checkout as you can see it is currently redirecting us to the cart page we can change it to the checkout page if for some reason you want to direct it, people to the checkout page you can come here and change it to the checkout uh, by default it will be cart page and it is also good that it is in the cart page so no problem with it and after making any changes you have to click on the save button so the changes will be live so this how we can make some additional changes of our bundle from this setting panel now let's click on the home now you can see that our bundle is already there you can see this is how we can enable the bundle in our product page now there is more option if i click on edit now there is a more option like we can add it to the specific pages like if you click on this you can only show it to the home page okay you can show it to the collection page or you can only show it with the custom code so if i click none this apply to co embedded code only so if i click on this and then if i go to the next options and save this and now you can see there is a embed code will be there so copy this code from here copy this code from here and we can embed this in our theme as well like if you want to add this to our home page or any other area of our product we can do that okay bundle launched so we can copy this and let's click on online store so we'll just copy that code and then we'll go to the customize of our theme if we want to embed the code somewhere else in our page we can do that also so let's check how we can do that so uh, let's click on the customize and then we can embed uh, this design to any page like home page or to any other custom uh, product or page if we want to it okay so this is also possible so let's see how uh, this will work what we can do we can just uh, we can go for uh, any product page if we want to right so let like the if i just okay so let us go to the uh, so you can see if i want to go to this one so let me click on sir so let me click on this product so not this one uh, the one that we have added the bundle to like uh, this facial scrub right so this one talking about so if we uh, want to add uh, this like if i want to add this to another section so let me add this like if i want to add add section if i want to add a image with text and then i can embed this here so you can i can click on this add section and and custom liquid code and then you can paste the code here the bundle be custom code here so you can see the code had been pasted so now the bundle will be showed here in that area right so let us uh, preview this if it is work. so now as you can see this bundle has been added here in that section with the custom liquid with embedding the code so this is the another way of adding the bundle in anywhere in any page in any section if you want to you can create new page and add this as well you can add this in the collection page as well like anywhere you can embed this using the custom liquid so this is the another option of adding the bundle from this app so it gives us multiple option it can get it can be placed under or below add to cut or with custom 
option with the custom code you can place it anywhere in your store as we did so this is the app that we can use to bundle one two or more products in our shopify store to boost our revenue so i will put the link of this app in the description you can check it out and add bundle to your store using uh, this to use using this shopify app and increase revenue for your shopify store so i hope you enjoyed this video if so please do smash that like button and if you have any questions let me know in the comment i will answer this so thank you very much for watching this video